Om Shanti. Welcome to 9th of December's Kali Blessing. We generally cry or we generally feel sad or depressed when our wants or desires have not been met in this world with people, with things and with any other kind of situation. So Supreme Father here says that with the power of yoga or meditation or connection with me or my remembrance, you can actually dry up the tears which flow in any situation. So here Supreme Father says, may you become an embodiment of happiness and cry proof by drying your tank of fear of tears with the heat of yoga. Some children say that so and so is causing them sorrow and that this is why they cry. However, even if that one causes it, why do you take it? Means even if somebody gives you sorrow, why do you take it? We only take it when we have certain attachment to a certain belief system about the self, about our nature, about our character, about our sanskar. And when that is questioned or hurt, then we tend to get hurt. That's one's duty is to cause it. So that one person who is trying to give you sorrow, that person's duty is to cause it. But you don't have to take it. You don't have to accept what they're trying to give you, any negativity any impurity towards you. Children of God should never cry. Crying has stopped. Both the crying with the eyes, but you don't have to take it. So, both the crying with the eyes and the crying in the mind. So, if you don't take any kind of uh, negativity, impurity or sorrow which somebody is trying to give us, automatically the crying of the mind will stop. Crying of the eyes will also stop. These two things will automatically stop. But the first thing is crying of the mind. Then God says, where there is happiness, there will not be any crying. Tears of happiness or love are not called crying. Tears of happiness or love towards God and tears of happiness are not called crying. Haven't you seen somebody who wins a lottery or who wins the talent show and then suddenly you see them crying? So those are tears of happiness or love. And they are not called crying. So dry your tank of tears with the heat of yoga. That means connection with God. Because take everything only from God. The love, the expectations are only from Him. And consider obstacles to be games. And you will become an embodiment of happiness. And this is what we learn. This is the attitude which we keep in Brahma Kumaris. And we learn this on a daily basis. You two are most welcome to learn this beautiful art. Om Shanti with this.